Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Cyclones, and when last we left off, we're looking for a scientist, hopefully alive, because we need his keycard that'll only work if he's alive and not stressed to gain access to the hangar, where an alien spaceship is located. We've nearly explored everywhere in the initial area of the laboratory, so let's go in this direction and find an ammunition clip that we haven't seen before. This one here. This is for the alien pistol. If we press C to bring up the cache of weapons we have, I didn't know that that was a shortcut we could use, we'll see the outline of the alien pistol, but we can't use it, because we haven't picked it up. I'll grab this ammunition, and I'll also grab this kit here. There we go. We'll uh, head this way now, and go to the only location that we can go to. The place that I got stuck all those years ago, because I didn't pay attention to the FMV. Let's go into here, and there is one area here that's very obvious. This area here, it has six chairs and four screens on the wall, and I was pretty sure that this would be where the scientist was hiding, but I just had to do something to trigger an event for the scientist to appear. That's not true, the scientist is a lot further into the facility, and this is the way we have to go, through a hidden door and we have detected some hollow walls. The game will keep informing us if we stand there until we move a little bit further in. Hollow walls are exactly what you think they are. Not these, these are transparent walls, and quite nifty for the time the game was made. These are hollow walls, walls that you can just walk straight through. There's another one too, so that we can get this mech kit and flip this switch. This is where I have no idea going forward of what the game's going to throw at me. I only recently discovered this thanks to that FMV uh, briefing telling me of this route and this location. And so now I'm stepping into the unknown, armed with this gun as the aesthetic of the level certainly changes. Now it's starting to look like a laboratory. Let us try our best to find if there are any enemies. There is an enemy right there! I do not want to fight you right now, so I'm going to wait for you to get closer. And you will! You'll slowly walk in diagonals and get closer, and when you do, you're going to see the Photon Chain Gun in action! Closer? You're getting there. You're not moving that fast, though. Do you only move when you can see me? That seems a bit peculiar because you haven't moved that much, and those shots are certainly accurate and rapid firing. Ah, there you are, hello! I'll move forward now, I think. Guess what? Chain gun! Much better. And I saved all of my health and armor there. Don't want to waste that, I only have so many mech and bio kits after all. No more enemies? Any doors or anything? There's a door over there. Hello! Anyone here? Doesn't seem like it. Hello! There really isn't anyone here. Ah, there's someone there, though! Hello! You're gone now, though! And you're gonna be gone soon in a moment! There we go, we'll just take care of you! You're gone too! We took quite a lot of damage there, but mostly to our armor. Nothing here, nothing here. Anyone in here? Yes is the answer! There is a pit bull and one grunt take care of the grunt as soon as we can. Can you open doors? I believe you can. And that is to your detriment. Here is another pit bull. And we're just going to take care of you as soon as you stop moving. Brilliant. Ideally I want to use the uh, pistol on the uh, pit bulls, so let's hope there are more of them down here. If there aren't, I'm going to have to switch quickly back to the- oh, there we go. There's one, and they do move fast. There we go, much better. We did take a little bit of damage, but that's okay. Anyone else? No? Good. We don't want to find any- ah, there is one enemy here. And you're gone as well. Anyone else? Okay. We're back into an area that looks sort of like an office. Definitely looks like an office now. Anyone in here? Well, there is a turret in the ceiling we need to watch out for. We're probably going to have to use the uh, photon chain gun for this. Chain gun! And I see another enemy. Quick switch over to this. Can you open doors? No, you can't. That's good to know. Any more enemies? Well, there's another pit bull. Probably going to be more of them, too. Any more? Not that I can see. 
but I'm not going to trust that. There's another turret over there, and no enemies behind me. We can quickly deal with a turret, I think. Aha! Eventually. There we go. You're gone. Switching back to the... No, let's actually not switch back to the pistol just yet. There's an area over there I can have a look. There's that. Looks very conspicuous. And indeed, it is something that I can go into. There appears to be a trail of blood nearby. Somewhere around here is probably going to be... Aha! A hidden doorway. Leading to a uh, chalk outline and some more ammunition. We can always do with more ammunition. Let's also use some of these, shall we? Just get back to full health and maximum efficiency, as the uh, game tells us, and keep exploring. We can't go through here just yet, I imagine. There's going to be, yep, some switches that we can uh, open. That's the way we came. Anything else? Well, there's another turret we can take care of. They're not that difficult with our uh, photon chain gun, and there's another one here too. They do start firing at us from a uh, distant range. There's this door. We need a pass key for this one. And there is another pit bull. Let's quickly switch gun. Just deal with you when you stop moving. It's being very tricky, but we were able to best the pit bull. Right, let's keep looking around. There's this place that we haven't been in yet, and we can jump over here, and here. Is there anything worth exploring over here? The answer is yes. There's a door, and there's an enemy behind this door. And here is some goodies. There we go. Don't want to uh, activate the mouse movement. There is mouse movement. You can control the game with the mouse. I'm not going to, because I prefer to use the uh, keys instead. So we'll go this way, and I think the best thing we can do right now is have a look at uh, this here. This switch, and this switch, and there were two more if memory serves. Yep, one over here, and one over here. Access granted. Brilliant. Let's have a look around, shall we? There are four doors. Anything over here? There's something we can pick up. A mech kit. Always handy. What about in here? An enemy. And I see up there what looks like you'd think that was part of the uh, thing in the background, just a bit of scenery. Nope. That's a pass key. We probably need that for uh, getting through that door. Anything? Oh, hello. You were sneaky, but not sneaky enough. I'll take this bio kit and this ammunition. Could have missed that ammunition if I wasn't paying attention. Over here is one enemy and one more of the uh, kits here. A bio kit uh, acquired. And before I leave this area, I'm going to go back to that hidden area and stock up on some uh, ammunition. Wouldn't be a good idea. Now I just need to remember where that is. There it is. Brilliant. I'll get more of this. There's quite a lot of ammunition there. Good. And now I need to go and find that door. It's somewhere around here. Of course, it'll be in the uh, final area of the circle. Here we go. Passkey needed, and we have it. There are lots of boxes here, some with SSI, and some that I didn't mention in the first level that had Raven on them. Another um, reference to the company that made the game. Let us go over, not here. There's got to be something in here that we could, aha, that we can open right over there. Gonna have to jump over this and have a look. We can open that as well. Nothing here. The scientist certainly is in a very well hidden location, that's for sure. Good thing to go through all of these secret doors unless you were told about them. Anything over here? No? What about over here? Another corridor. More enemies down this corridor, more pit bulls, more grunts, maybe? So far, nothing. I'm not gonna trust that there's nothing down here, though. There is a doorway. Let's go in. Okay, this looks like, yep, a dangerous location if ever I've seen one. Let's switch to the pistol. There we go. Take care of you. Anyone else? Probably going to be a couple of, yep, I see a couple of grunts there, at least one. I'll open the door for you. 
need to get you in here so I can take care of you. And there's one more of them somewhere. There you are! There are two more of them! Come in! I have enough course pistol ammo for all of you. Even the grunt over there. Just uh, take care of you, and then we're gonna switch back to the uh, photon chain gun. Be very careful. There you are! Hello! You took a lot of ammunition, probably a lot more than you should have, but you're gone now. Any more grunts around here? I think the main threat were the pit bulls. If we'd have gone uh, way too quickly into this room, we'd have been in some serious trouble. So what is the gimmick here? I know there's a door nearby, I saw it, it's over there. Activate power panels for operation. Are these power panels? It's, yes they are, power panel active. We need to find more of them, like this here. Note that they don't appear as anything that we can use, we just have to go, ooh that looks peculiar, and then click it. This one here, I'm surprised we can reach them, they're quite high up on the wall. The security doors are open, and they're just open. We can't close them again, so let's take care of you. Excellent. Anyone else down this corridor? There's another pit bull. We can take care of a pit bull. And another pit bull. I'm surprised they're using so many pit bulls and not grunts, because pit bulls cannot shoot me. And I do have a lot of ah. Speaking of grunts, there is a grunt. Let's wait for the grunt to get a bit closer. Or maybe we can just move up to the grunt. Seems like a good plan. Have at thee! Here we go. There are also quite a few pit bulls here, but we can deal with them. Here we go. I think we're going to need a, uh, yep, we're going to need a mech kit there. Any more foes that we need to take care of? The answer is most likely. Oh yes! The answer is yes! They're coming to get me! Let's deal with you. There are two of them there! You're gonna open the door eventually, and when you do! Ha <laughs> ha! Chain gun. We're going to save. You may think that there's only one slot. There are these not so obvious buttons here that you can press to cycle between other save slots, so we're going to save here. There we go. We have saved, let us return to the game, and try our best not to die to these enemies. From AI Core, scan show doors in area interlocked. Open one to open another. Gotcha. There was another enemy somewhere around here. There are also some gun turrets, as I can see. Need to watch out for them. Any more gun turrets? There's one in that corner. Let's have a look around here first and enter into this door. Ah, hello! How are you? You are now gone. What was in here? A bio kit and lots of fire extinguishers. Very handy if we need to put out any fires. Hopefully there won't be any fires in the near future. Nothing in here it would seem. There is a bio kit. And is there anything on the top of these? The answer is no. Bio kits are always handy though. Let's go into one of these corners and take care of this gun. There we go. Should we got it a moment? They don't fire that often, that's for sure. They tend to just fire a little bit and then stop. Anyone in here? The answer is no. Doesn't seem like there's anyone in here. Doesn't seem like this room's important at all. Let's go over here and have a look in here. There's an enemy and what looks like, yep, some ammunition. We want some ammunition, so we'll just grab some. Marvellous. Ammunition is now at maximum, and I feel like using one of these and one of those in a bit. We seem to be running out of uh, mech kits a lot faster than we're running out of bio kits. Take care of you, and go into here. Aha! There is a kit. We'll have that. And there is something up there too. You'd have to be careful to see it. Another bio kit. We'll have that. And we'll go into one more room. Right here. What is in here? The answer is not a whole lot by the looks of it. I don't trust that there's nothing in here, but it does seem like there's nothing in here. No switches or anything that we can use, so this room serves 
no purpose. And then this room serves a great purpose for getting me loads of awesome items that I just never found them. We'll use that, and we're gonna get ready to open up one of these doors. Okay, there's the scientist, and also some enemies. A lot of enemies, actually. I want them to come to me. There's an enemy over there as well. I'm not sure they're going to come to me. They seem pretty content uh, to wait in there for me, which is quite smart. Let's see if I can take care of them. One of them's gone. Oh wow, there's loads of them. There's loads of them. There are at least two or three. More, that is. There are already uh, a number of them that I've taken care of. Is it a number? One. I've took care of one. If I go to this door, Oh, I can just open this door and take care of somebody from that angle. Okay. Is there a door here? There is a door here! There's an enemy there I haven't seen before. I believe that is an NCO. One of the more higher ranking, uh, Cyclones. You're gone, and they died rather quickly. Now I need to take care of this one. Have at thee! Oh, damage critical! Wow! That enemy did a lot of damage. Thanks for your help. Here's the key. I can get out on my own. That's good, because I'm not going to be able to help you. Ouch! Yep, gonna need to use that, gonna need to use that. Going to need to be a lot more careful when I face you in future, because that hurt. However, I do think that is the level done. This should be an elevator. And it is. So let's go in. Once on board, extreme caution must be used. Only a preliminary scan was conducted before the ship's auto-dispense computers kicked in. All AI equipment and personnel were destroyed. And at this time, no scans can penetrate the hull of the ship. Intel can give no further information on what may or may not be going on inside the ship at this time. Once again, extreme caution is urged. Once the ship's internal situation has been assessed, Proceed with the powering up of the ship's engines. Once engine power is restored, proceed to the command section. Once command section is located, find the data input section. It's the one with the round blue monitor. When located, place your hand on the palm print. An encoded nanochip placed in your hand will input the needed data into the ship's computer. The ship will then autopilot itself and you back to AI control. Well, that's handy, but on the other hand, not handy. We've been given very clear instructions, but we've no idea of the layout of the interior of this alien spaceship. I'd have much preferred to get a map, but we're not going to be so fortunate. And I'm a little concerned about the fact that we have no idea what we're going to be facing. Not knowing is always dangerous. Any enemies in here? Not that I can see. Ooh, there's something there, though. Goodies that I definitely want. And there is a gun ball. Or two. Or five. Damage is indeed critical. Let's be a lot more careful than I'm being, shall I? My health is practically non-existent. Let's use that. Because I'm slowly having it be whittled away by the gun balls and by these pit bulls, who may have been able to shoot me even though I wasn't on the same level as them. I'll just grab this mech kit here. And a bio kit. It's very handy that uh, these aliens have the same kind of uh, mech and bio kits that we use, otherwise I'd have died a long time ago. That is nothing, it's just a piece of scenery. What does this do? It would seem this does nothing. I have no idea where I need to go, I only know that I need to go somewhere. There's a button there. We are out of range of the button. I bet I could jump and press it. I can. Can I jump to that? I can jump to that. That is what I need to do. These are doors. The music is uh, slightly different here. Do I want to go further? One more door can't hurt, and this is when one door really hurts. Oh, this is going to be a maze of some variety, isn't it? It probably is. This is going to be a dangerous, dangerous part of this mission indeed. That's not to say that all the other parts aren't dangerous, because they're all exceptionally dangerous. And so, when we come back, folks, we are now in the alien ship. 
we want this alien ship, hopefully it has information that we're going to uh, be able to glean from it that will help us fight the aliens. And failing that, at least we'll have an alien ship. We might need it to go back to their homeworld or something like that. Knowing this game, that's probably what's going to happen. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.